Okay, dear student, let us see what is there in this question. A satellite orbiting a planet moves from the orbit X to orbit Y. So it is going from X to Y. Okay. What is the change in the kinetic energy and the change in the gravitational potential energy as a result? So my dear students, in this question, there are three formulas that I'm going to tell you. And you have to always remember them. Don't get confused. Like whenever you are talking about energies in the gravitational field, you are bound to get confused. I'm like 99% sure about that. So be very careful in this in, in this kind of question. You see, the formula for the potential energy, gravitational potential energy that we are going to use is this. So this is the most fundamental gravitational potential energy formula that you can derive it from the work done and the hell lot of theory is there. We first of all find the work and then we find the potential energy. So in many other videos I have done that. So in this video, I'm directly going to the formula and the kinetic energy is again plus GMM by 2R and the total energy is the negative of the kinetic energy, which is where r is the radius of the orbit small m is the mass of the satellite and capital m is the mass of the planet so these are the formulas in respect to which we are going to think this question we are not going to use half mv square it is valid but we are not going to use we are not going to use mgh this is not even valid here this is not even valid for gravitation purposes. This is valid only in topic two, mechanics. Otherwise, this formula is not right. There are many conditions to derive this formula. Okay, let us now concentrate here. So let us first comment on kinetic energy because it is positive. So R is increasing. The radius is increasing. So clearly you can see if the denominator is increasing, the value of the kinetic energy will be decreasing. So I'm sure that the kinetic energy will be decreasing. No doubt about that. Now let us go for the potential energy. Now the potential energy is like R is increasing. If R is increasing, the value of this is decreasing, but it is negative. So it means that it is going from, let us say minus 10 Joule to minus five Joule. I've just taken the example. So the magnitude is reducing, but it is the negative sign also there. So it means that the potential energy is increasing. And my dear student, please try to understand this thing that in the case of gravitation, we take the potential energy to be zero only at the infinite distance and all the way to the center of the planet, the gravitational potential energy is always negative. It is never positive. It is either zero or negative and it keeps on increasing as it keeps on moving towards the center of the earth. So here it is minus five and here it is minus 10. So you can see the potential is increasing as you are moving near to the planet. Now it is moving away from the planet. So definitely the potential is increasing. So the gravitational potential energy is basically increasing from minus 10 to minus five. And so the answer in this case will be C. My dear student, here there is another point that you have to concentrate on. In this particular question, the total energy is like, the total energy is also changing. Because you see this, uh, this is the radius and the radius is uh, changing and so the total energy is also uh, getting changed here. And we are not even adding any energy into it. Many a times there is a rocket that, that is supposed to be used and all that. Yeah, that is what, like, that is the only method in which we are going to change the total energy. So um, according to me, like, if it is going from the orbit X to Y, definitely the total energy has to be changed. There will be a rocket there and that will be working. Yes, uh, earlier I think um, I misread the question. So uh, there will be some changes in the energy also, even that total energy is increasing. So the rocket is firing. So the chemical energy of the fuel is converted into the mechanical energy and which is reflected as the total energy of the satellite, which is also increasing. Is it okay? So total energy is also increasing. Okay, my dear students. So the answer is C. All the best. Bye.